channel. I'm so sorry that I've been gone for so long. I know I took a while of a break and I'm finally back though. I've just had a lot of things going on. Um, I actually just got over having the flu about a week ago. So I do sound a little bit hoarse, so I do apologize for that. A lot of things um, have been going on. Um, I'm in the process of moving. Um, I've been like in different jobs and stuff. So a lot of stuff has changed over the past year or so that I've been on here. This is a new year. I really look forward to kind of getting back into the things I was really passionate about and one of those things was YouTube and also just, you know, talking with you guys, sharing my experiences, you know, reviewing products again, hair extensions, which is actually what this video is going to be about. I'm so excited to be back and I do apologize for taking such a long break, but I do have a lot of new videos I want to make and updates I want to talk to you about. So let's go on and get into the main portion of this video that I'm going to be talking about. So I do have a new hair extension brand that I'm going to be reviewing today. Now this is a brand that I saw on Amazon and so I did reach out to them and I said hey your extensions are very different I'd love to try these because I've tried you know you've seen my videos there's and hopefully if you haven't then you can always click through um, but I've reviewed so many types of hair extensions I've reviewed clip-ins I've reviewed wigs synthetic ones human hair ones even ones I haven't made videos on I've tried like tape-ins I've tried glue-ins I've tried sew-in so I've tried a lot of different types of hair extensions over the years now this one is very different because it's a different form of application. It's a lot faster in my opinion. It definitely does feel more comfortable than a clip-in. So this one is considered a halo extension. Um, also my hair color is different. I did dye my hair and I also did dye these extensions to match my hair, which I'll get into in a second. This brand, Lavu. So this is how the brand's name is spelled. And this is the box that my hair extensions came in. So I did get these on Amazon. I'm going to put the link down below so you guys can check it out for yourselves and see if you're interested. I've been testing these for the last couple of days and I have honestly really loved it. I'm going to get up in a few minutes and kind of do like a little turnaround so you can see from every angle what my hair looks like. I'll show you guys the back and everything like that. And also how to apply it, how to take it out. It's very, very simple. The one I got was the Lavu 18 inch, it's 80 grams of hair. The hair color I got is number eight slash 14. Let me go ahead and show you a little close up of the box. Hopefully my camera decides to focus. I'll go ahead and just, you know, put all the information in the description below. But this is the box that it came in. And then it tells you the information on the back. It's got their like social media handles. And then the description in the back just says, Lavu Hair is a company focused on customer service and product quality. We have specialists in the production of real hair extensions for more than 20 years. We always choose the best material for, hum for human hair and guarantee the customer a perfect shopping experience. Love our hair, enjoy your life. So that is what the box says. And these hair extensions are made with 100% human hair. So that is one thing I noticed because I've had extensions in the past where they say, oh yeah, like we're 100% human hair. And then you put your like curling iron through it or something and it just like melts or you try to dye it, it doesn't dye. This one took my hair color so well. And this is permanent hair color. So it wasn't just like a little semi-permanent or anything. This was actually hair color. If you're interested in the way I got this hair color, uh, let me know in the comments down below. I would love to like kind of explain that in more detail, um, what color I used, everything like that, how I did it. So the hair extensions themselves, I did save the packaging so I could show you. And also I'm gonna put footage of what the hair looked like before I dyed it, before I even touched it. It was just like brand new. It was gorgeous. It was like a nice, um, kind of like an ombre so it had a little bit of like a lightish blonde brown color on the top and then it faded to a nice blonde color so it was a perfect canvas for my hair color to go on top of um of course if you have like blonde hair brown hair dark hair there's a lot of different color shades um as options for you but personally because my hair is such a specific color i did end up dyeing it myself which is not a problem i love doing my hair anyway so it's not really a big deal to me you can always take it to a hairdresser as well to get it colored styled matched to your hair i haven't cut this as well i just dyed it and styled it so this is the packaging so it was in this long envelope and it has a little cardboard backing and then it has extra um 
little clips in there and it has extra string. I know it's very hard to see because the string is invisible. So if you've never heard of Halo hair extensions, basically it is a couple of wefts put together in one piece and then it has a little fish clear wire string. It's a very flexible string and it goes right above your head, kind of like a headband. And it does have two clips, which is very helpful because I feel like for me, I was kind of worried about, is my hair going to be secure? Is it going like, to move around? And this hair is very secure. I can move it and I don't feel like it's going to fall out. It actually lays very flat to the head, which is super nice, super comfortable. Uh, when I wear clip-ins, I feel like it's very stuffy. I feel like it's very um, thick. I could feel the wefts when I'm wearing clip-in hair extensions, but the halo hair extension feels super comfortable. Babu did an amazing job because I don't feel like I'm wearing any extensions. It feels so natural and it just flows. Like I've worn this out when it's windy, when it's like rainy, nothing phases it. I've just, I haven't had any issues with it at all. And just as a disclaimer, I am reviewing this hair and it was sent to me by Labu to give an honest and genuine opinion. And I just, I've honestly, I'm very picky when it comes to hair extensions, I'm not going to lie. This is the first application of a halo hair extension that I've ever tried. And at first I was kind of scared. I was like, what if I can't figure it out? What if it's like, you know, what if I can't blend it? What if it's not enough hair? Because it's only 80 grams, but it is very thick. I mean, I have pretty fluffy, thick, curly hair, and this still manages to look good. And I haven't even cut it or anything, so I'm actually very impressed. So I'm going to stand up really quick so you can kind of see more up close, like the color and the hair, the texture, everything like that. This is what the hair looks like. This is my hair mixed with it, obviously, but I'll take it off in a second so you can see. But I really like it. It feels so comfortable. Like I said, it lays really flat to the head. And if you look at my part, I don't know if you can see, but the wire is somewhere in here. I can't even really feel it, to be honest. That's how like subtle it is. It's like here somewhere. It's a very thin, invisible fishing wire. It's a flexible wire too, so it's like very hard to even like feel it. Like I don't feel anything in my head. Like it just feels super comfortable and natural. So this is how like the hair looks. And I will go ahead and turn around so you guys can kind of see like back of my hair. So I hope that was a good view of what the hair extensions look like from a distance. So you can kind of see how they flow and everything. So now I'm going to go ahead and remove the hair extension so you guys can see what the piece looks like, how simple it is to remove, and also what a difference my hair is going to look like when it comes out. So I unclipped the two little clips in the back. And what I like to do when I take it off is I try to reach for the little wire. There it is. And then I just like carefully remove it from my hair. And I did curl my hair together with the extension to kind of make it a little more like, oh my gosh, I look like I'm bald. <laughs> um, this is the hair extension piece. So it came out very easy. And I've already washed this hair twice. And even with any hair extension that I've had that I loved before in the past, if you wash the hair extensions too much, they tend to get kind of dry and weird. These ones have stayed so soft. Like, I wouldn't even have to really do anything. Like, I'll put conditioner and stuff, but it doesn't really feel like it needs it. But it's very soft, very pretty hair, very healthy feeling for sure. Look at that shine. It's so healthy. I mean, this is so soft. It's softer than my own hair, and my hair's pretty soft. I'm gonna stand up so you can see how short my hair actually is. I just got my hair cut recently, so it's a bit shorter. But this is the style of my hair without the extensions. It's like the length and everything, which I don't mind. I mean, I like my hair, but sometimes you just want a little bit, you know, more extra oomph. And this is what kind of gives me that extra oomph. So I'm gonna give you kind of a close up of these hair extensions and how they look. 
so it might be a little messy because I was just wearing them but this is the fishing wire I was talking about so this is what sits on your head like a headband and this so this would be like right here in like your scalp area and then this is the little band so this has a bunch of weft tracks in there and it's covered by like a nice lace piece and then there are two nice sturdy clips and they have rubber so they can grab onto your hair very very nice it does help make it feel more secure when it has those clips on there like that but this is the other side and what I love is that it's so thin like you can't feel any of these hair wefts if you were to part this hair like you can't see any of the tracks or anything so if it actually were to show on your head which it's very hard to like even see it because I actually tried it like I had some friends tell me that they didn't even know I was wearing hair extensions they were just like what and I don't know if you can tell but because I ordered these with kind of like an ombre on them there is a subtle ombre which I like because my hair kind of has that natural ombre effect so it perfectly matches my hair but this is like the color of gloves and like I said these are 18 inches so this adds a lot of length to my hair when it's in your head like i said it kind of lays a bit lower so it, for me it goes like all the way down here there's two ways you can apply this halo extension and i personally will show you the way i prefer it just because the one way i feel like if you have your hair curled it'll kind of make your hair frizzy because you kind of have to pull your hair out of the the halo and i just don't you know i don't really like doing that personally because i feel like it messes up your hair I like to do it where I section off just like the top crown area and then I place the little halo on top and then I kind of just blend my hair over top. So I'm going to show you step by step how to apply this. It's very, very simple, very fast. If you're a person that's on the go or just doesn't like to spend a lot of time doing your hair, this is a great way to do your hair in literally like the fastest amount of time. So to apply this, you're going to need like a little hair clip. You can use a little hair tie or you could just hold your hair in place, but I feel like it's a little easier if you use a little hair clip. So I have my little piece ready. I'm going to open the little clip in there so uh, I like to do is you're gonna wanna you don't even need a pick comb for this honestly I'll just use my fingers it's like so simple you don't even need anything so I like to kind of give myself a couple inches of space in the front and then I'm gonna just pick up hair all the way to the back like so so it's not even perfect, it's just, I'm just pulling it up all the way around, just lifting that hair out of my way. And then I'm going to clip this up for just a second, it's not going to stay there for long. So I've got my little clip, put my hair up there. So now I'm going to take my little halo, and what I like to do as well is I try to push my hair forward. So you're going to kind of have something that looks like this. So then you get your little halo, and then I'm going to go over that clip that I just put, and I'm going to set this right there. And in the back, just kind of feel to where your hair is not parted, like where your hair is just laying straight down, and then just go ahead and clip it to your hair that's flowing down in the back. So I already clipped it. So it's already secure and everything. And I'll pull this forward so you can see the length already. Like it adds so much length. Okay, so then I can go ahead and get my clip. There we go. And the key to making this work is you kind of just like play around with it. Like you kind of just pull your hair out through here gently. Like you kind of just, you just use your fingers and just comb it through to blend it with the little hair piece. So you kind of just, it's very fast. Like I will say like, that's one thing I love about this is that it's probably the most simple. You don't have to be clipping in a bunch of pieces into your hair. It's just very fast. I feel like honestly that already looks good. Like I don't even feel like I see any string showing. So I'm very pleased with this application. I feel like it's so easy. And this is coming from a girl that is like so used to wearing clip-in hair extensions all the time. I really do feel like this hair really changed the game for me. I feel like, why haven't I tried this sooner? I just feel like, I don't know, it's just like so much easier. Like you saw me apply this, it's so easy. Taking it out is really fast and easy. 
So that is how you apply the Lavu hair extension piece. Like I said, I am very picky about hair extensions and these ones have impressed me so much. Like it's ridiculous. So I'm going to link the information about these hair extensions down below so you guys can check it out and see if you're interested in trying Halo extensions for yourself. And I want to wish you guys a happy new year. I want to wish Lavu a happy new year. I want to say a thank you to Lavu for letting me do this review and trying out their hair and giving my honest, genuine opinion about it. I'm very, very impressed. I would definitely buy this again because I genuinely just... It's just great. I really love this hair and I hope you guys will love it too. Let me know if you guys have any questions, comments, or concerns about it. I'd be glad to help answer any questions that you guys have. Thank you guys so much for watching. You're amazing and I'll see you next time. Bye guys.